Whenever I'm looking for new magicians to have on the show, I go to the preeminent voice of the magic community, that's CNN's Jake Tapper. Please welcome Tapper-approved magician Blake Voigt. So I say that because uh, Jake Tapper told me about you, and yes. he said I am going to love you because I love magicians. So amazing! Hi. hi, hi! Thank you for having me. Thanks for being here. I'm excited to show you some magic. Okay. And for the first trick, I'm going to need some help. Okay. Okay. So Andy, would you please join us over here? Please give Andy a round of applause. <laughs> this way. Nice How are you? So you? you can stand right here between okay. us. Now you guys have a lot of magicians on the show. We do. Right? Good magic, amazing magic. Mm -hmm. But I noticed that not a lot of magicians teach you guys tricks. No, they don't. So how about you guys like get to learn a trick today? Is that exciting? Yeah. Audience? <laughs> yes? Okay. So unfortunately, in order to do this, we're gonna have to sacrifice one person that doesn't get to know how the trick works, and that's gonna be Andy. <laughs> right. Is that okay with you, sir? It sure is. Okay, is that okay with you, audience? Yeah. Excellent. Okay. What are they gonna say? No? No, that's true. So Andy, first thing I want you to close your eyes. And Ellen, if you wouldn't mind placing your left hand over Andy's eyes. You're not scared. Is it scary? Or your right hand. It no, was... it's not scary. It's not scary. He Either th hand just he so he doesn't. We're think. doing something. I don't know what we're doing. This is a magic trick. I know. This is a magic okay. Trick. Okay. All right. Don't don't close yell. your, close don't your yell eyes. At you. Keep your eyes closed. Close and what we're gonna eyes. do is hypnotize you. Okay. So audience, we're gonna count backwards from five. Five, four, three, two. One, perfect. Okay, so Alan, now you can remove your hand. Andy, okay. you can open your eyes. Andy, yes or no, do you feel hypnotized? Ish. <laughs> not really. That, if I'm being honest, not really, but I don't know that's okay. what it would feel like. It so. would have been weirder if you said yes, okay. to be honest. Okay, all, all right. We're going to move over this way. Okay, okay, Andy, I'll have you stand right here. Ellen, if you can stand right here, and I'm going to stand right here. Andy, I'm going to have you pick a few cards out of a deck. Okay. And we're going to see how hypnotized you actually are. Okay. Okay, so I don't want to know the cards. Ellen, you shouldn't know the cards, but it's just for you, Andy. Okay. So please reach in and take out one card. Good. Look at it, don't let Ellen see, don't let me see. Okay. And then once you know the card, Andy, don't show the cameras. I want you to place it face down in your left hand and place your right hand on top, sandwich it, and hold it right over the table. And I want you to stare at your hands, okay? Just okay. stare and concentrate on your hands. Now, Ellen, if you wouldn't minute. mind, step right over here. Andy, just keep staring at your hands, and okay. I'm gonna try to receive one card. Keep looking at your hands. I know. Okay, concentrate, I'm gonna try to see one card and concentrate on one card. Okay, perfect, okay, Ellen, we can move back. Andy, I think I have something. Okay. Yes or no? Andy, are you thinking of the eight of spades? Let's see. The eight of spades! That's insane. <laughs> what? Pretty cool? Wow. Pretty insane. Pretty insane. But I'm the magician. You'd expect right. me to be able to do that, Andy. That's crazy. How much cooler would it be, though, if Ellen read your mind? Wow. I don't, I, want, I don't want to know what's in his mind. <laughs> We'll make it quick. We'll All right, quick. okay, I'm okay, ready. Okay, Andy, I'm gonna have you pick another card. So definitely don't let Ellen see this one. Take it out, look at that card, memorize it, and then assume the position with the card between your hands right over here on the table, and stare at your hands. Okay, just I am. Stare at your hands, concentrate on them. Ellen, take a step aside. Andy, just look at your hands, and Ellen, I want you to try to receive one card. So just try to see one card. Don't say anything out loud, Ellen, but I think okay. you should receive one card. I, uh, yeah, okay. Okay, Ellen, we're gonna move back. And Andy, what I want you to do is stare into Ellen's eyes. And Ellen, please read Andy's mind and tell him what card she is thinking of. <laughs> I'm thinking five of diamonds. No way. Are you kidding me? Whoa! <laughs> wow. Amazing. How did you? You looked at me, Amazing. I don't know. You looked at me. You looked at me. Well, you obviously know that. No, I don't know. You're okay, just... let's try one more. Okay. Let's try one more. The ultimate version of this, Andy. And the Ellen. audience knows. Well, how about that? Here, I, yeah, I, don't I got know. an Somebody idea. knows something that what I don't. What if the entire audience, what if the entire audience could read your mind, Andy? Are uh, you guys up for that? Yeah. Andy, last round. This Take out crazy. a card. Definitely don't let me see it. Don't let Ellen see it. Take the card out. Look at the card and then assume the position once you know the card. I'm gonna stay over here. You can lower it so I, don't, I couldn't signal them or no. anything. Ellen will stay over here as well. Andy, look at your hands. And audience, I want you to try to receive one card. Try to think of one card. Audience, don't say anything out loud. Audience, Andy, concentrate on your card. Uh, you audience, you should have one card that's right a now. magic move. Okay, that's a good magic move, man. Yeah. That's a really good one. Okay, so here we go. Audience, one, two, three. Two cards. Shut up. <laughs> The two of us!
Pretty wow. cool. Pretty wow. cool. Now we're going to move right over here. Step oh, the, right back to where we are. Now here's the yet. main question. The question of the day is audience, yes or no? Should we tell Andy what's going on? No. Oh, yes. <laughs> they said no. Yes and no. Well, here's the deal. Yes. Andy, I'm a little bit nicer than them. So I'm going to tell you. Please. We've actually got somebody under the table. The thing that people don't realize is it's actually your very own Twitch, everybody. There was a girl that climbed under there. There was a girl that climbed under there. I don't know what he did. It's crazy. I was actually dancing with the reindeer, and then all of a sudden, wow. Andy is more confused than before. I don't even understand. That's, I mean, we all saw a girl climb under there, right? All right. Wow. Mike has one more trick for us after the break. That was amazing. All right. We're back with magician Blake Voigt, and uh, we have one more trick. One more quick trick for you. OK, so here's what we're going to do, Ellen. I'm going to take cards, and I'm going to drop them onto the table like this. And whenever you want, you just call out stop for me. OK. <laughs> awesome. Stop! OK. <laughs> Here is your card. Don't look at it just yet, but I'll tell you, if you would have stopped me later, it would have been that. Earlier, it would have been that. But you can show me and the audience, Ellen, which card did you get? I got the three of diamonds. Three of diamonds. Random, right? Mm -hmm. Now, here's the thing. There's three sections of your audience, left, middle, and center for us. Which section would you like? Um, oh, God. This, don't make me pick. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. yeah. I just, I'm just going to pick uh, this section. Okay, okay. Great. Perfect. So in that section, let's see, second row, one, two, three, right there, third seat, yes, you. Would you mind, before the show started, I placed one card in an envelope. I sealed that envelope, and I actually stuck it on the inside left of your armrest, your left side. And would you please tear open the envelope and stand up for us and show us all what card did I place in that envelope? The Three of Diamonds! <laughs> Pretty cool? Pretty cool. Thank you. Now, here's the thing. I told you before I teach you a trick, right? Yeah. This is actually the trick I'm going to teach you, because how this works is really freaking cool, OK? First things first, Ellen, we didn't set anything up. No. I didn't tell you to stop on that card. Regular deck, it could have been any card. But what people don't realize is that there's 52 seats in each section. So I hid 156 different cards. If it would have been the four of diamonds, you would have looked. The two of diamonds, you would have looked. If everybody looked, don't open the envelopes, but tear them off and hold them up. I hid 156 envelopes. <laughs> now here's the thing. Ellen, everybody claps when the trick happens, but nobody claps when they find out how it works. Right? Yeah. <laughs> because the tricks are better when you don't know. Right. Right? And once you know, you can't unknow. Yeah. But what if you could? Unknow. Unknow. OK. Everybody, take your envelopes. They're all different, but tear open the envelopes. And let's check. Should you have the three of diamonds? The three of diamonds? The three of diamonds? We did it! <laughs> wow. So that's how it wasn't just her. It was anybody. But still, it was a three of diamonds. Yes, and you still didn't, t you didn't teach us that part. I didn't. I, I lied a little bit. All right. There. Okay. That's fantastic. <laughs> Thank you You're so You're amazing. Much. Come back, please. Yes, of All right. course. See more of Blake's Magic. He'll be performing this month in Los Angeles. For tickets, go to dreamhotelmagic.com.